music of Katie McMahon. Katie, it's great to hear the, the, the Celtic music that gets you in the spirit. And you have a, we have a concert coming up we'll talk about. And but I want to know more about, about you and, and everything that people have gotten to know as you put your band together and your music is, is always so fun, especially this time of year. Sure. Well, I um, came here originally, gosh, about 10 years ago now. Uh, I was the lead singer in the Riverdance show mm -hmm. and uh, met my husband, who's from St. Paul, backstage at the Orpheum Theatre and uh, moved here. And I always loved Christmas music yeah. and I wanted to combine it with the Irish stuff that I grew up with. So I thought I'd put together a show and I also have Irish dancers in it. And then I like a lot of these sort of old-fashioned carols that people are really familiar with. Um, so we put a lot of those in as well. And we have a band and singers as well. Yeah. Well, we had a, I had a chance to hear the band mm. and, and listen. And, and it is really, it's, it's enjoyable, incredibly talented people. And, yeah, they're great. And I think there's no better time than now when people want to go out to a concert like this. It makes you feel good. And talk a little bit about what people can expect if they go to Katie McMahon's Celtic Christmas coming up at the O'Shaughnessy. Well, um, when I was young, I would have loved to go to a show like this because uh, especially as ch a child, we have a special uh, child rate for tickets and uh, we have children who are actually performing with us. A lot of the dancers are very young. Uh, they range in age from six years of age to 16 and so people will get a kind of like a mixture of river dance and carols and we also like to keep the theme very Christmassy. Um, uh, I'm, I'm a Catholic and I'm all into the sort of story of Christmas and to celebrate that so they'll get the real deal. <laughs> It, and it does seem like a family-friendly event, mm. and, and not not all of them are. I mean, it, it seems like this time of year, parents got to pick and choose, and and you want something that's meaningful and and good for the parents to enjoy themselves, because you know, kids shows are fun, but in the holidays, it's nice to maybe have something a little more than that. And I know you you have that in your shows. Yeah, we try to keep it very tasteful altogether. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, how did you put the band together? And you found how did you find these talented people? Are they from this area? Are they from all over? Or? Yeah, they're all from here in the cities and um, they're wonderful and a lot of them come from different sort of musical uh, disciplines than I do. We have classically trained people, people who are really into bluegrass uh, or jazz or our percussionist Mark Anderson, he's like into the African drumming. Hmm. So a real mixture but we're all playing Irish music. Um, a lot of the singers would also be classically trained, but then they've branched into being in bands and all sorts of things. So it's a great mixture of people. And the, the holidays, we encourage people to go to the website. You can find out more information about Katie McMahon and, and really the upcoming concert, of course. But if they want more information or other things that you're involved with, they can find it all on your website, right? Absolutely, yeah. KatieMcMahon.com. Yeah. And if they're looking for tickets, uh, they're available Ticketmaster and other for your mm -hmm. event and I love the O'Shaughnessy it's such a classic theater yeah and, and, and I imagine that that setting is even better for what people can expect coming up on the 12th and we have loved working with the people there they're all fantastic is there anything new and different that you mix in every year or what if they've seen you in the past what what different this year might they well, find we always try to incorporate a lot of new music every year so that's that'll be the kind of new thing and we'll add different pieces and we're also uh, gearing up to record a new Christmas CD. Really? Yeah. Can you give us a little hint on where that might be yeah, going? Yeah, it's going to be called Christmas Angels so a lot of the sort of angel themed carols we're going to incorporate to that so people will be able to hear some of that music at the show. And, and now that you've been here for a little while again in our area we're lucky enough to have you now mm -hmm. How are you finding, are you enjoying how you're received here in the, in the, in the Midwest and, and the Twin Cities in particular? Oh yeah, I, I really love this town. I have to say that, you know. There's a few Irish people here too. Yeah, we, I mean, even when we <laughs> came here with Riverdance, we were just looked after so well by mm. the Irish American community and I've made great friends here. I, I really like it. Even uh, coming back from Ireland this summer, I felt I was actually coming home this time, which was wow, you know. And you're, and, and River Dance was, well, their loss is our gain, I guess is what we're saying, right? <laughs> that we're able to get you. And that has been amazing. I mean, mm. it still is. It's, it's an amazing show. I've seen it several times, and every time I've seen it, it seems like it's a new show. 
I yeah, mean, it's, it's amazing yeah. what that is. We're glad to have you from that. Well, thank you. And we're look at encouraging everybody again, go on out on the 12th. It'll be a good family experience. And mm -hmm. for more information, of course, on everything you're up to, you can go to the website, right? That's right, yeah. And as we close, should we uh, hear a little bit more from you and your band? Oh, absolutely. Recorded right here in our studios. I know. Let's, uh, well, tell us what they're going to hear at the final. Um, they're going to hear Good King Wenceslas, mm. which is all about the true meaning of Christmas, uh, uh, basically helping people who are a little less well-off than you, as Good King Wenceslas does. Such a great theme for this time of year, yeah. too. Again, go to the website, find out more, and as we leave you, and thanks to Katie McMahon, uh, here's a little sample of what you'll hear at the concert on December 12th. And stand by me, if thou know'st it telling. Yonder peasant, who is he? Where and what is dwelling? For he lives a goodly kens underneath the mountain, right against the forest fence by Saint Agnes' fountain. Bring me flesh and bring me wine, bring me pine logs hither. Now and I will see him dine when we bear them thither. Page and monarch, forth they went, for they went together. Through the rude winds, wild lament, on the bitter weather. Sigh, the night is darker now, and the wind blows stronger. Fails my heart, I know not how, I can go no longer. Mark my footsteps, good my page, tread thou in them boldly. Thou shalt find the winter's rage, freeze thy blood less coldly. Shall yourselves find blessing?